So have you ever seen a link that looks like this? So this is what I was talking about here, where we have a package ID. So instead of just one, we see a 101. And what happens when you do 11 or 12? That's a pretty simple IDOR. And so we can see all these different references here. And it really comes down to how the database query occurs on the back end. So all the stuff you're doing here gets translated. Well, not everything. If there is a database query, if the website is performing that query, so it's basically translating what the user is doing into a database query that then gets executed on the database underneath. So this is by doing this, by clicking this in and putting it in the URL, this is what is being performed on the back end. It is pretty confusing uh, how it works, and it takes some time to wrap your brain around it. I always encourage people when there is a difficult subject, just like proxies and stuff like that, draw it out, write it down.